Hey guys, it's Levert01 here. Today we are going to make a motion based solar system. So, colors is going to be velocity. Uh, we are going to do, um, yeah, realistic, sure. Alright, so let's make our still star. Just gonna put it right there. Um, it's kind of blue, you know. Motion, position lock. Um, alright, so view. That's orbits, grid, zone. Alright, so let's add our first thingy, which is a random asteroid, which is going to be an orbit. It's going to be an asteroid that's there for no reason. Next, we're going to have a rocky planet here. And one here. Now we're going to have a planet here, planet here, planet here, planet here, planet here, and then a gas giant here. Alright, so here's our solar system. Except Lunus Poe, which is kind of cool because it's a red planet. It's going to have a moon around it. No, that's a little big for it. Too big. Let's put something like that. Oh, this planet's got issues. It's burning hot. I am the red sun. I am the red sun. Red sun. Red sun. I am the red sun. Red sun. Red sun. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, as usual. Alright, let's take a look at Tescalugort. I'm a Tescalugort. I'm born to this. Yes, pa. Wah, wah, wah. Alright, now let's look at Rigbort. Ribigort. Herbigort. We're gonna add a, a huge m Huge, huge m here. And, and a second one. Ibernust. Hi, my name is Ibernust. Here's our onion. It's like an onion, but an onion. Alright, and this is gonna have a rocky planet, buddy. Here, this probably ain't gonna work out, but who cares? Alright. Anazic. Anazic is my name. Anazic is my name. An Anazic is my name. An and sick. I have issues. All right, let's get back to this. What's up? No, knuckle gorty. Kind of parents name parent names their planet knuckle gorty or sun or whatever. Random small moon. This is his smallest moon, knuckle gorty. Uh, big moon. Big moon. Bigger moon. Yay! Alright, so, and then. Let's, uh, watch a. Alright, let's play. And see how quickly stuff starts to get messed up. Alright. Ah! Ah! What happened? Did it blow up? Did it blow up somehow? Let's go to go to chart. Planet emitting gas. Stop being so gassy, Massy. Alright, All right, so let's look at these guys over here. Lunas Poe. And his ticked off moon. What's what is he made out of? What have you been eating, child? Let's look at Ornyus. Ornyus, 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 Ornyus. Then there's Taskel, Taskelgort. Yo, yo, the name's Taskelgort. 
I'd buy you a friend, but I ain't got a quart. Well, I can really rhyme, can't I? I can't rhyme my f I can rhyme my face when I'm with you. Alright, this is a bad idea. Did you hear that dramatic music start up? And it's going yellow and it became red. Stop tick tilting axis. Maxis axis. What is this line supposed to be? Wow. Is that the magnetic axis or what? Motion. I don't know, but let's add anyway. Let's add a let's launch a huge rocky planet. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa! It's colorful. People like me have problems, don't I have problems, don't I? Motion. Alright, now the fun part. Wow, that was fun. Alright, now let's make the now let's make the star go boom boom and see what happens. Oh cool, now there's a habitable zone for the star. I also might have made the simulation lag out like psycho. I don't know. That was a close one, wasn't it? What is that, gamma ray? Alright, uh, view. View. Velocity realistic. Whoa! Ah! Lagging out. Actually, this isn't so bad. What has happened to you, Lunny? It is Poe. 
What is happening? I don't understand. Je ne comprends pas. Huh? The heck? Is it just getting incinerated into stuff? Alright, wait. What if we pause time, add a random exoplanet, right? Let's put it still right here. What will happen to it? I want to see the slow motion of it. This planet's going to get incinerated in seconds, won't it? Yeah, it will. I mean, after all, this is a freaking supernova! Ah! It's going to heat up very rapidly. Oops, I bumped the mic. Sorry, guys, you've been experiencing technical difficulties. <laughs> Alright, anyways. I'm burning up! Somebody help me! Alright, this is boring. Come on. Come on, blow up already. I want to see you explode. Die. Die, rebel scum. Die. Why are you not dying? I want to see this rebel scum die. This rebel scum is not dying even though it's a freaking supernova. Um, alright, I think it's dying now. Looks like it's dying. I mean, it is becoming completely molten. If that's a, that's a sign of it. If that's not a sign that this thing is gonna burst, I don't know what is. It's turning golden. Ooh, it looks yummy. Can I eat this? Because it looks yummy. I'm hungry now. I ate dinner really not that long ago, so that's a problem. I'm burning! And maybe we can slow down a bit now. Alright, so how hot does it become after it looks like it's super cold? Right now it looks like it's super cold, but what happens after it look super cold. Does it look super hot? I mean, what? No, it already looked super hot, so now it looks super cold, so does it look super duper hot after this, and then super duper cold after this? Nobody knows. It does look cool, though. How is this realistic? There's burning light up here, and yet there's a shadow over here. Doesn't make sense if you ask me. And wow, I'm impressed with my simulation, my computer simulation ability. At this point, I thought it would melt it along with the comp with this planet. You know, it's probably like how when when something when there's something is so hot that it starts to feel cold or when something is so cold that it starts to feel hot and it's your body like trying to deny that's one extreme it's like and the plants doing the same he's like uh, nope nope I'm not gonna die in massive 86,000 degrees Celsius temperatures and nope nope Uh, surface temperature. What is this in? F you don't have Fahrenheit. I'm American. I'm special. I need my own special, special measure unit of measure mind. <laughs> Give me Fahrenheit. I'm tired again. Why are you not burning up? I'm waiting for you to explode coolly. Coolly. Eh? Please explode coolly. What? What? Why is that? Oh, it's starting to gas. Oh, he's becoming gassy. He's burning up, guys. He's burning up. He's burning up, guys. Still, he still weighs 7.6 Jupiters, but oh well. 
That's a problem we can solve. Alright, how are there exoplanets like this? I don't get it. I'm, I'm, I, I, je ne comprends pas. Yanni Pani Mayu. Wow, this supernova looks awesome. You're surrounded by pretty colors. I'm bored. Hurry up and die already. Please die. Oh, what are you doing? Are you spinning now? Does this look like the time it is to spin? Does this look like... Okay. The heck? How is this planet... What? How is this planet not dead? Does this make any sense? I don't... Un what? No, I'm done. I'm done. Let's just admire the pretty supernova now. That's grown freaking huge. Oh, it's in the habitable zone for the star. That makes everything better. Please scroll out, because I'm done with the lag. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done with the lag. I want no more of it. Please... Please stop. Thank you. It's a supernova. I want to see what it looks like after several years. Ah, it's flying at me. Please stop flying at me. I'm pretty sure it does not become that big. I'm pretty sure it doesn't become 1,800 light years big. Because if, if it did, I think we'd be dead. Kind Yeah, kind of dead. Yeah, I mean, it's like, um, pronounced D-E-A-D- What? This looks weird for- This looks weird to me. Alright, well that was fun. So, guys, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe. I know every video I do, I tend to deviate from what I actually plan to do at the beginning. For example, here I kind of plan to um, do a velocity solar system. But when, when things get boring in Universe Sandbox 2, throw a supernova or a black hole into it. That's the lesson you should take from my videos. So anyways, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more. And Lever to One, signing out.